Hi, I'll be going over the umpire process for longest substring without repeating characters. So for understand, so um, our input is a string s, and then for output, um, for output we want the longest substring without repeating characters. Um, so if we have um, forgiven forgiven s equals a b c a b c b b then our output should be three because as it says right a b c is our longest substring without repeating characters And then um, if we're given B, 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 then our output should be one uh, because B's um, repeat so many times. So we can only have um, B's our long substring without repeating characters. And then um, we have P, W, W, K, E, W as our given string. And then our output should be three because our longest substring without any repeating characters is W, K, E. So that'd be our longest um, substring. The length of our, and our length, the length of that substring is uh, three. So for match, um, I don't know if I've seen this problem before, but I think we did have a similar problem uh, in an earlier module. So I think like using the two pointers comes to mind. So pointers, and then we have to, um, for that one, we, uh, I don't know if there's that problem or one of the video walkthroughs or solutions went through like using a dictionary. So we can use a dictionary for this. And then um, we probably have to, like use the max function to find like the max length. So um, so the plan would be so we so if um, string is empty, right? If it's like zero, then we just want to return zero. Uh, but otherwise, we can create a dictionary, so create a dictionary or a map. And then um, I want to create a max length and start uh, variables. So these variables will keep track of the max length and then um, this would be like one of our pointers. So there's like a start uh, and a and a start pointer variable. This will keep track of um, like the beginning of our longest substring. So then we want to use a loop to iterate iterate over the string. And then, um, then we want to check uh, check if the current element um, is in our dictionary, and um, so we just want to check if we have a repeating character in our substring. So. Uh, check if we have a repeating character and our index is greater um, than the start. Uh, so I mean a start variable we got will we'll, um, our pointer will start at zero right so we just want to make sure that um, this, so if we have a repeating character and our index is greater than zero, 
then we just want to so we find our repeating character right we just want to update our pointer to the next index um, but in every iterate iteration of the loop we want to um, so we want to store store our current index um, in our dictionary and um, so we want to update max length um, so update max length um, based on the largest between max length and um, uh, and then max length and our current index minus our starting index uh, plus one. So um, so for so this will happen in our if condition, right? So we want to check if we have a repeating character in our substring, but otherwise we're just um, updating a current index. So we're trying to find the longest substring, and then if we're finding, um, we're just updating that index of the longest substring, um, and then our max length is equaling what's bigger between. Uh, so if we find a longer substring than what we have in max length and we update it. Otherwise, we keep uh, max length the same. So for implement, um, so for implement, um, let's see, so we have to check um, if uh, our string is empty so if len s is less than one then we want to return zero <laughs> otherwise um, yeah otherwise we create our dictionary so we can say index is our dictionary and then we create our max length variable to refine the max length of um, the longest substring without repeating characters and then we have our starting pointer. And so we I iterate over the, um, the string. So for i in range len s. So if the char at the index is repeating, so if it's in index, and then um, uh, in the, the index, of um, so yeah, if our if our char is in, uh, repeating, like it's in, we've already seen it in our dictionary, um, and the index of our repeating um, character is greater than or equal to start. Then we just want start to um, our starting pointer to equal the next um, character. So we do index and s i uh, plus one. So yeah, so. Um, so yeah, if we find a repeating character, then we just update um, our pointer to equal the next index. And then, um, and then as our, leap, our loop keeps going, we're trying to find the longest substring. So we're looking at index uh, from our start to our current, um, current uh, index, so so index s i i rate equals i. So we're looking at our current index, 
and then we're just trying to update max length to equal um, it's bigger between uh, ma uh, max length and then um, our current um, our current index minus our so our current pointer minus our end pointer and then plus one and then we just want to return x length so let's run it so yeah we'll get all three test cases yeah and then we will get it obviously I've been working on this for a bit I wasn't able to get it before and um, I had to like change my approach so yeah this will be my solution and then uh, let's see and so for evaluating so for evaluate um, I believe for time this is O of n right we only use one for loop and um, it will depend on the length of uh, the string ever given for the time it takes for the solution to run and for space um, let's see so index um, I want to say O of 1 because we use constant space. We're just using these variables. They're updated um, in the loop. But then, you know, our space remains constant throughout because once our loop is done, then these uh, variables go away and we're only left with max length. So I'll say O of 1 for space. So thank you. That's my solution for um, longest substring without repeating characters.